Everyone who works around electrical equipment should know how to help a victim of electrical shock. One of the first things that should be done is to report the situation. Another is to cut power to the area if possible. If the power cannot be cut, you'll need to follow your company's specific procedures for what to do as an alternative. In some cases, it might be possible to use a non-conducting pole or rope to separate the victim from the electrical source. In any case, though, you should not touch the victim with any part of your body.